Jamfru nas gulle åt stugen gå Linden darar i lunden Så tog en den vägen att skogen blå Till hon var vid all skogen på hunden Han har som han kom till skogen blå Linden darar i lunden Där mötte henne en ols och grå Till hon var vid all skogen på hunden Sjara hulver då biten till mig Yeah, look at that cool church over there. It uh, has to be one of the coolest churches in Norway. I think it's quite old. It's uh, from the medieval age. Yeah, some important guy was probably buried here. But it's a big, nice church. It would be interesting to look inside it. Yeah, I'm pretty sure the church is currently closed. Yeah, if you look closely, you can see that uh, there's not only crosses on the roofs here, there are also dragons. <coughs> yeah, I can see that uh, little tower right there, that's where they used to keep the bell. Because, yeah, they didn't have the bell inside this church here. So yeah, hopefully no black metal guy burns this nice church down, so yeah. This is the main place where people enter. But yeah, of course it's closed, so yeah. Quite, an, quite a cool church. And the tower right there. And this... Uh, farm is probably where the priest used to live so yeah yeah definitely one of the coolest churches we have in Norway probably the coolest so yeah
ja. Always funny to crash icicles. Yeah, just look at that big wall of pure ice. It's very slip slippery going up here. A lot of ice hidden under the snow, so yeah, this sign right here says that there's a new path because the old path up this uh, mountain is so destroyed by heavy rainwater, but I think I will still try to walk up the old path. Yeah, it's quite exhausting to walk up here. Yeah, right here you can see the Norwegian coat of arms in the middle of the mountain. You see? The Norwegian coat of arms. It's just a sign that says that it's a nature uh, restoration. <sighs> oh, it's so exhausting to have to crouch down to get under the trees there. Do you think it's safe to walk out here? Well, I can see the grass on the ground. It's just a bog with the snow over. But you should always be careful to walk on frozen lakes and waters when there's snow on them because uh, uh, the snow is, sun is, is insulation. So it heats up the things under the ice under the snow. So yeah, the I center the snow can melt because of that. Just so you know. So you don't die in a stupid way. Useful to know. Yeah, I just fell here. Just completely frozen ground under the snow here. It's actually actually quite difficult to, <laughs> to get over here. It's just so fucking slippery here. <sighs> yeah. This is so refreshing. It's so exhausting to yeah, walk up mountains in snow, so it's always great to have some snow and ice to cool down with. I think I've reached the summit. Yeah, I'm probably up here all alone. Yeah, there's quite a big cliff here. Yeah, I don't have much sunlight left, so I guess I have to try to get down this uh, mountain again.
And yeah, here's the mailbox to the local uh, mountain trolls that live here. So if you want to send them, send them some mail, you just have to deliver the letter inside of this mailbox. I guess the, the trolls up here might get kind of lonely, so it would be nice to send them some letters. Now I just have to find a way back down. Yeah, so uh, I'm heading down the mountain now, and yeah, how to get down before darkness because uh, there's quite cloud out, so I don't think we'll get a lot of uh, moonlight, so yeah. But it was nice being up here. Uh, it's a nice feeling of being alone on top of a mountain, although I met two hikers, but yeah, it would probably be way more people here during the summers, so yeah. So yeah, it's nice being alone out in the wilderness. I don't think I could ever live in a big city or something like that. So yeah, it's uh, very slippery, so hopefully I will survive this uh, journey back down from the mountain again. <laughs>